welcome back to another North Carolina mountain adventure. So in my last video, I, I'd made a homemade bullet stop and I wanted to share with y'all what that bullet stop was made of. So here's the reveal video and I'm going to retrieve every single caliber I shot into it, except for the 30 out six and 30 out six passed all the way through it. So no retrieving that one, but let's take a look at, look at that target. Okay. There's where the 30 out six went in the 22, the 44 mag, the 9mm hollow point, plus P, the 9mm full metal jacket. You can see this shiny layer. That's how thick and how much aluminum foil I compressed. And as well, you can see the layer of duct tape. And then I got 60 sheets of construction paper and then another layer which is this little bitty thin gray layer right here of duct tape so duct tape construction paper duct tape aluminum foil and that's what my target was so here we go this is where the 22 went in right here then we got the nine millimeter plus p corbon hollow point and the nine millimeter full metal jacket that's how thick it is so i split it open and now you can see the tin foil in there but to my surprise the projectiles are in this half nothing penetrated into that half so i'm gonna do a little further digging and i will be right back So, as I was pulling it open, you can see right there is a hole. The full metal jacket fell out. Now, you can see right here, on it, it, so it made it through the construction paper. It made it through the construction paper, the duct tape, and right as it started into the tin foil, that's where my hollow point stopped and it went the same distance the 22 is right there right beside it there's the 22. so i've retrieved both nine millimeters and 22. now i'm going to go over to the other side and go after the 44. so right there is where the 44 magnum 240 grain full metal jacket flat nose went into and as I pull it open, okay, this is the front half. Entry here. It's going through this way. It stopped right there. Right there's the bulge. See that big old bulge? That's what she said, right? So, okay, here we go. I don't know if you can see it, but it's right there. Come on. Right there's that big old bullet. Oh my. I cannot believe. How that 44 Magnum. Flattened out. that is just amazing because that 44 magnum was not a hollow point i showed everybody when i shot it in there and the expansion on that 44 magnum is just mind-blowing i guess yet another testament to how sturdy my little body armor was so let me get the projectile set up and i'll be right back so here's the final results. I got them all out and I'm going to show them to you in the order that I shot them. First, starting with the 22. Get the lighting right. 22 hollow point. First one I shot. And there's the projectile. Flattened out pretty good. Believe it or not, that 22 penetrated just as deep as that nine millimeter 
plus P did. That's what I carry in my everyday carry. And then there's the result of it. Just flattened out quite a bit. Then you then we shot. Then we shot the 9mm full metal jacket, 115 grain. And this is what we got out of it. Put it in a nice little round configuration there. Almost rolls around like a ball. And then we shot the 44 mag. As you can see, it's a flat nose full metal jacket and there is the projectile the brass wrapped around the soft lead so it had a brass cap on it and there's the lead man look at that thing as for a comparison there's a quarter it is it, it almost opened up to the size of a quarter started off this size finished out that size so you know i'm kind of looking forward to finishing out the rifle one i'll be curious to see if i can make it perform as good as i did for the one with the pistol it's going to be made up of the same thing it's going to be made up of aluminum full 150 feet of it 150 yards of aluminum pull again 60 sheets of construction paper on each side and two dollars and thirty cents worth of pennies that's all i'm going to put into this and be curious to see how it does against the rifle rounds so be looking for that video to come i'm still working on the bullet stops as always eyes open no fear stay safe out there <laughs>